So I just walked for an hour on a speed of four. So about 3.8 miles. I was not having a very good mental health day this morning, so I just did some exercise and I already feel so much better. So this is your sign if you feel super stressed out and overwhelmed, maybe just work out because you'll feel so much better. Honey, you like your little bed? I made some mahi for my lunch. I have the mahi on arugula. I put a ton of red onion on it, carrot, avocado, and as usual, tons of green onion. I'm gonna add a big squeeze of lemon to it. Well, I am getting ready to get ready, and I have on this t-shirt, so you know I just self-tanned. But I will check back in with you guys once I am done. Wait, I'll do like a transition. <laughs> you know how I was telling you guys about how I'm going to be putting shelves back here? Well, I have the shelves now. And this is what they look like. Uh, they'll be shaped like L's. Oh, oh. They'll be shaped like an L. Like that, kind of. And I just can't pick what brackets I want to use for it. I really just cannot decide. Um, obviously, I have a lot of brass finishes in this bathroom, and I really like that look. I'm just not sure how exactly I want to do it. And I have planned to paint the... Um, I have been planning to paint these white before I put them on the brackets, like very like Scandinavian like house kind of style because I'm gonna have baskets on them. So now I'm debating maybe not painting them because I do like that it's light. I like the knots. It's like a shade lighter than our ceilings in here. So you'll have to stay tuned to see what I end up doing with that because I really just can't decide right now. I didn't style my hair at all. This is just my natural hair whenever I brush it out once I get out of the shower. And hopefully I can just kind of leave it like this. I like the look of it right now. And I did switch out my shampoo because I was having issues with my roots getting oily. So I switched to the Care Of Curly Hair Shampoo. And I double shampooed this last time. And I feel like it is way better. Um, <laughs> I washed the dishes. Oh, goodness. Okay, I might need to redo my finger tan. Because that's not great. <laughs> Hopefully. Oh, gosh. Moo, are you okay? I just stepped on a cat. Looking at that in the camera, oh my god, I need to touch up my hands. <laughs> Here, you guys can hang out with me while I do that because I like to use a brush when I do it. Helps a lot. I've super moisturized my, I have super moisturized my fingers today. So, this should be fine to do, but typically I would just cover my hands in lotion let me just go over this a bit more and I'll tell you what I'm going to do tomorrow. I am going to Charleston. I'm going to go to my old gym in the morning. I can't wait. And then I'm going to go to this delicious restaurant on Sullivan's Island. It's called The Longboard, I think. Or maybe just Longboard, but I think The Longboard. And they have this oyster deal where every oyster grilled or raw is only $2.00. So we're gonna go and enjoy that and hopefully get some cute pics on the beach. And of course you guys will be hanging out with me whenever I go to do that, so. You will get to see all that fun stuff. Very excited for it. And I think that'll be really nice time for like me to take for me and not be doing laundry or dishes. Or editing my vlogs. Not that that isn't fun, that is fun to me, but Taking care of the house sometimes can just be such a not fun activity for me. And I wish I was one of those people that naturally I was like, Ooh, I can't wait to do the dishes or fold the laundry and put it away. But I am just not that girl. I wish I was. Life would probably be easier. Well, I don't know if life would be easier. But it's just not something that naturally I want to go do so you know I just have to it's like one of those things where you just don't think about it too much and you can get yourself to do it 
You just go through the motions and then suddenly it's done and you're like, yes, I did it. I'm going to make some cashew milk that I saw Savannah Montana make. And you just take water, cashews. I couldn't find any that weren't salted, so I guess mine will be a little salty because I love a cashew milk. I'm obsessed with anything that's like milky, like dates too. I love that. Put a little cinnamon in there. Also some dates. Oh, where are they? Also some dates and a little bit of vanilla. Hold on. And damn vanilla. Where are you? Cashews. We got some cinnamon. Some vanilla. Mine's in a mason jar because I dropped it and the lid broke, so I had to move it to something else. This is a teaspoon measure. I'm just gonna do a teaspoon. These are not pitted, so I'm just gonna pit a couple, add those in. Now I have 10 dates left and I can make this like healthy Snickers bar recipe that I'm obsessed with and it has pistachios on it. So good. I had some issues with the other blender. It like the tongs of it wouldn't, or like the teeth wouldn't catch in the blender itself. So I think I need to replace that. But we're just gonna use this. That'll be perfect. This is actually so good. Wow. I would drink this every night. Tonight I'm going to make us venison meatballs and I'm going to stuff them with like little mozzarella pearls. So I'm really excited to see how that's going to be. Now I'm going to use this pan to cook the meatballs and then I'll put the sauce back in it. I'm cooking down the peppers and the onion because no one wants raw onion and especially no raw jalapeno in their meatball. Okay, I have all the meatballs rolled, and this is the first time that I'm doing, like, big meatballs like this. So I'm going to coat them in some breadcrumbs because I think that'll help it get nice and crispy on the outside. Here we have the tomato base with heavy cream, and I'm going to salt and pepper and add in some parmesan. Here's how it turned out. Oh, wow. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> Good morning. I decided last night, honestly, that I was going to be putting together the vlogs from yesterday and today because today will be a much more fun and exciting day with a lot more getting accomplished. My outfit right now, it's so cold. My outfit right now is so funny wearing my gym shorts, but what I have on my Uggs <laughs> um, with it because it's freezing. But I'm actually going to town and meeting up with Lizzie. We're going to the gym. Then I'm gonna shower at her house, get ready, and then we're gonna go to lunch at whew, on Sullivan's Island at the longboard. I'm really excited. I haven't, um, I actually don't think I've been there to eat yet. So that's great. Hopefully we'll be able to get some cute photos while we are at the beach. But again, it's supposed to have a light breeze of 11 and a half miles per hour. I don't even think I could run that fast. So, I don't know, we'll see. I might end up just being cold. I feel so cold this morning already. So, we're just gonna see how that goes. Oh, also, my nails are done. Ooh, I love some length on those bad boys. Watch out, Cash, I'm literally backing up like a snail. My coffee maker isn't working this morning for some reason which is not ideal oh also i forgot my sunglasses i always forget my sunglasses let's see but i obviously didn't get ready because we're going to the gym because oh jeez. why do i not remember my sunglasses nice and espresso-y very good i got some egg bites you already know all right, we just went to the gym. You and Quinny. Beautiful. Look how cute these little proteins are. Protein drinks. Protein drinks. Shakes, yes. Look how cute these protein shakes are that Lizzie's making us. Slay. 
cheers. <laughs> Here is the outfit for our cute little lunch. And I'm gonna wear like a puffy outer jacket. I'm not gonna be cold, but I'm obsessed with this little top. Like, look how cute the little flared sleeves are. Too cute. I didn't think I could love these sleeves anymore, but look how cute they are sticking out of the jacket. I can't. The shirt is my new favorite thing. My vibe is like pirate, white flowy shirts. It's just my look. And I love it. These look so good. Good eye. Got a little coke. Well, we just went on the beach. And Lizzie is literally the best, shout out her, because she's got some fire photos of me. Check it out later. <laughs> but it was so cold. Alexa literally told us it was gonna be a light gust. She's like, light breeze. And as expected, it was, I think I talked about this earlier. I think I was like, I can't even run that fast. <laughs> 11 miles per hour gust or light breeze. Yeah, I think you're running about five miles per hour. Yeah, I'm doing 12 through 30. So if you flatten me out on take away my three incline, I should be at at least five. <laughs> All right, but I'll take you in this cute little plant shop we're gonna go to. You're the gonna best. you're gonna like it. Do I look like a colonial person what? with like you know those old men oh. in the wigs with the socks with their little clogs? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, some, I just got a flash of that. It actually is all so cute. Everything in here is so pretty. I do love that too. I think this is what I'm gonna get. This is giving like girly apartment vibes. Yeah. yeah. Like, absolutely. I want it all. I wish I could keep it all alive. This is what I made. Here is the plant that I went with. Oh. This is a Norfolk pine. Closely related to an orchid. <laughs> Thank you. Where's my line? <laughs> So she said, this is a Norfolk pine. It's closely related to an orchid. <laughs> yeah, that's funny, but it is cute. If the lighting would just quit being such a bitty, you could see it. Oh, it kind talking? of looks like an herb. It does, it looks like rosemary maybe. It looks herby. Herbaceous. <laughs> is that the word? <laughs> that is a word. But is it Herbaceous. the word for this? I don't know. Does it stink? Mm, it smells like nothing. It just stabbed me. Don't don't touch it. Mm. Okay, maybe I should have gotten her a fucking pokey. That's fine. Whatever. Oh. Hey guys. So I just wrapped my day with Lizzie. It's 5:40 and it is already this dark outside, which is crazy. 
Um, so I'm sorry that the lighting's not awesome, but I just want to give you a heads up. If you're ever on Sullivan's Island, check out Goldbug. They have really cool like build your own jewelry with charms and different. Let me turn off my view. My blinker actually. With charms and like different chains you can choose from, which is pretty cool. So I am just gonna start my drive home and I'll check in with you guys whenever I make it back. Thank you so much. Or I could just end it here. Thank you guys so much for watching today. I will see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 15.